Tell a friend to tell a friend that do it all all the time. And we're back with another NBA 2K24 Next Gen Jump Shot video. And man, when I say shooting has been a struggle after the latest patch, and this jump shot right here is cash money for this particular build right here, man. I'm not going to lie to you guys. This is my, I would call this my Giannis Kevin Durant build, you know, because this build can finish really, really crazy. And it can shoot at the three-point line in the mid-range. So, I'm an 89 overall. Let me go ahead and show you guys the build. This is what I have on the build. I haven't put anything up. Um, so, you know. We're just going to roll with this right here, man, and I may put something else on this build once I get done with my point guard. So um, this is what we have right here. If you want to screenshot this, the build is on the channel. Y'all know I don't gatekeep. I show you guys what I got. And this build has potential now to get better. I mean, it has room to get better. You know what I'm saying? So uh, for the three-point shot, we got an 80. But I did an 84 on the mid-range shot so I can get gold, catch a shoot, gold, mid, and magician, and things of that nature right there. Um, so um, the shooting is good on this build. Don't get me wrong, okay? So uh, we're going to get into what you guys came to see, and that's the jump shot. I'm not going to hold you any much longer. But, uh, yeah, man, the jump shot right here is cast, man. Let me see which one I got equipped. Let me make sure because I created a bunch of them. I was testing a bunch of jump shots out. I got to make sure I got the right one. I choose the wrong one. Okay, yeah, that's it. I see it now. Okay, so this is the latest one that I tried out, and this is the one that I I really, really like for this build. So for the lower base, we got the white power. Really smooth base. Kind of remind me of uh, David Robinson base. Um, if you know anything about David Robinson base, I probably can show you if I can get David Robinson base. I should be able to get it. Let me see. Now, see, look, look at the white power. Did the white power now, and I'm going to show you David Robinson. Look, same base, <laughs> same base, but you got to have an 86 to get um, David Robinson, which is crazy as hell, but you know, we're going to, we're going to stick to the white power, man. I was able to find this base and it's pretty, pretty good, man. I ain't going to lie. Where is it? Oh, there you go. You know what I'm saying? So same base, same base. Okay. For up release one, we got Nikola, jo uh, not, yeah, we got Nikola Jokic for up release one. Okay. Really, really smooth. For up release two, we got Jared Jackson Jr. His uh, release is kind of flat, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I put Jokic in there with it because Jokic has the higher release or whatever. So um, for the blending, this is what we got. Release speed, uh, we got at the fastest, okay? For the animation blending, we have it 50-50. So uh, that's what we got for that. Like I said, man, to get Jared Jackson uh, Jr., as you can see, uh, you need an 82 three-point shot or 82 mid. For Jokic, you need an 82 or 82 on the three in the mid. Uh, for the white power to get that base, you need an 82. Okay, so uh, this sorry, this is not for my like low three point shooting people, but this jump shot is really really cast. Now let me show you what change I made to start making shots. Right, so I tried all all the different timings out or whatever. So uh, I used set point. Okay, I used set point before the um, the patch, and after the patch, I was still trying to use set point. So I went back and I tried to use the other ones. I used every last one of them. So. I finally went to release and I like, man, you know, release kind of give me a little bit more room for error. So, um, you know, I got to hold it a little bit longer. So a lot of the shots I still take, they be early. But, um, you know, I, I didn't got used to it these past few days. And I'm telling you, it's cash, man. So make sure you add this jump shot, test it out. Let me know what you think about it. I'm out of here, man. Ciao! Yes, sir. I'm in the pro-am with it with my homie DP and my homie A-Town. So I did fast forward the game, man, because I scored eight points. And this is my first shot right there. As you can see, it's green bean. Make your girl scream. You get on that horse, you gotta ride it. The game was extra long, man. You know, it was a struggle, man, coming into the Pro-Am playing and, you know, just trying to get back in the groove of playing in the Pro-Am because that's where you get the most VC at. And when you create bills like us and you don't want to spend money on VC, man, go to the Pro-Am, you get, hell, you get five, 600 VC for a loss. You know, if you get if you win and get player of the game, you get 1,000 VC, you know what I'm saying? So it'll take you under five minutes to get 1,000 VC, man. Uh, uh, you know, and, and I think that's pretty good you know so i come in here or we come in here um and try to get as much vc as we can even though the game is not playing good we don't care if we, win, uh, if we lose or not because we just trying to get the vc man to be honest with you guys so um like i said that was my first shot um in this particular game but i will show you the shots that i missed it's because i'm still used to a set point on the timing so i still kind of release my shots a little bit early you know what i'm saying so um, i'm getting used to the muscle memory with it being on um release 
because I have to hold it a lot longer than set point. And if you know anything about set point, you know that set point is really, really fast. Okay, so um, like I said, I'm still getting used to it, but you're gonna see that um, I do make my shots with this build. Uh, maybe it's the gold catch and shoot that helped me out a whole lot, you know, because I do have gold catch and shoot on this build, and that does help me out a whole lot, man. That's a really, really good bad. So if you can get gold catch and shoot on your build, please add gold catch well not add it but uh take your attributes up high enough to get gold catch and shoot because i promise you you would thank me later okay because a lot of people they can get it done with silver don't get me wrong get some people out there that can shoot really really good with silver you know but if you could get gold catch and shoot i would say get gold catch and shoot man i think that's a great badge this year okay like i said i did take one shot already and i'm gonna show you the shots that i missed and uh you know kind of critique it a little bit you know what i'm saying because that's what i do to myself as you can see i'm wide open right there eight times late on the pass because his passing is not good on this bill he's on this lockdown and i think dp is on his uh lockdown uh if i'm not mistaken um so you know i should have had a shot right there with my takeover on but as you can see i'm on 24 percent on my takeover and it's going down man and um unfortunately i won't be able to get a shot off with my takeover on i really wanted to but i i really want to show you the shots without the takeover to be honest with you guys i don't really like for my takeover to be on when i'm shooting um you know because i want to show y'all that i really can shoot without the takeover you know because when the takeover come on it's almost automatic depending on your three-point shot and depending on uh, how good of a shot you take or whatnot but as you can see my takeover did go off and you know it's cool but um you know sometimes i shoot it with the takeover on but if i can if i can shoot it without the take out takeover on i would do that for you guys to show you that the jump shots are cast without it you know so um that's just another thing that i like to do now as you can see i'm wide open right there but i didn't take the shot because i didn't have any energy all right now some of y'all probably would have said oh i still would have took the shot but you know i didn't want to take a slow shot because if you move around too much on this game the time you go shoot the ball man it's going to be slow you know and right there i kind of forced that up thinking the shot clock was really really low but it wasn't that low you know what i'm saying and you know i made a mistake there and i messed it up for my teammates and the score is 13 to 13 right now and we're still trying to get a bucket man and um i still haven't taken another three um but you know like i said when i'm open i shoot you know i'm not going to force no shots um if i'm if i'm open i'm gonna shoot the ball you know simple as that okay so now i'm trying to get to my spot i'm trying to set a screen and you know the game is not moving good i'm not gonna lie man it wasn't moving good he leave me open right there and that's my shot man that's a green bean make your girl scream you get on that horse you gotta ride it so at this point i am two for two from the three-point line you know i could have just stopped shooting right there and like oh i'm gonna give y'all a jump shot video no we don't do that man i'm gonna keep shooting i don't care if i'm two for two i don't care if i'm five for five bro i will keep shooting you know what i'm saying like it's not gonna be a point to where i just stop shooting just to make a video no i'm not doing that you know because i've been testing this jump shot right here before the patch and after the patch okay i had it on for a while as you can see right there guess what i missed that shot so i'm gonna show you guys to miss it and as you can see it's slightly early okay because i'm still not all that used to holding the shot for the release okay so i'm getting used to it you know every day is is is, is a um a, a challenge you know what i'm saying and i will get it you know you better believe that i will figure it out because i'm not trying to figure it out for me i'm trying to figure it out for the people out there that are struggling to shoot you know what i'm saying somebody came in on, on the channel the other day and it kind of made my day man he was telling me how he used one of my jump shots and it's still working on uh even after the patch and that you know he's shooting better look at that shot right there look at that shot air ball <laughs> i was <t> <laughs> i was too far back man i ain't gonna lie that was a big air ball right there man but we needed a three man so i'm like man i gotta do something you know and i thought i could make that shot but he leave me open that time guess what that's cash man green bean make your girl scream you get on that horse you gotta ride it this game came down to the wild man 19 to 19 we need two points that was a clutch shot right there man as you can see three for five from the three-point line i did shoot an air ball yes we shot an air ball okay nothing changed man we still in the game you feel what i'm saying i came back and made a three you feel me so we on defense and all we needed to stop man and buddy them i thought we was just gonna lose this game because how the game was moving like like you do stuff and it, it, it don't register you know what i'm saying like you make a play you think you make a play and and 2k just do something else you know what i'm saying so 
But this particular game, we just had to just strap up, man, and play great defense this game. And as you can see, we're moving, we're rotating, and we're switching, we're calling stuff out, we're communicating, and all that stuff, man, you know, and we're just trying to get a stop because all we need is two points, and we win. Or if they get two points, they win. That was a good box out by me. I passed the DP, get it to A-Town for the easy two. That's what I'm talking about, man. We did get the win right there, man. And um, like I said, three for five on the three-point line, man. Try those visual cues out, man. Try release, try set point, try push. Try everything you can, man. Go out there and test it out, man, before, you know, you um, just stop wanting to play the game because you can't shoot. That's what I did. I feel more confident when I shoot. And I call my shots out when I shoot because it feel good, and I like that. As you can see, I had 17 points, but I was three for five from the three-point line, which is great. 916 VC, man. Y'all better get in this Pro-Am if y'all want to get some VC, man. You know what I'm talking about? And uh, that's it, man. Uh, like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel. No matter here. Charge!